when I was diagnosed, I couldn't run the laps like all my friends could. So they sent me to the school nurse and she heard something. So I in turn went to a cardiologist um, and they ran tests and I had dilated cardiomyopathy. Um, and back then all they had was digoxin. So that's all I was on. It was 1982. But in 2012, I decided to get genetically tested. Um, I felt that that could help my family and this history of cardiomyopathy. So I found out that I had the MYH7 mutation. Um, and so my children got tested and my girls ended up having the same mutation. So I feel that since I made the decision to genetically test our family, we it, it's like treatment as a whole. They treat our whole family similar and we're doing great. I have a 45 EF. My youngest has like a 30, 35 EF and my oldest just went up to 38%. Back in 2012, um, I go to a teaching hospital and they were throwing it around while mom and two of the kids have cardiomyopathy. Let's see what mutation they have. And so they brought it up to me, but we were kind of, you know, they kind of didn't know what to do about that back in 2012. Um, but Harvard was having a study. So we, um, they took, took our blood and sent it off. And that's how they found out. 